Joe, another three years at Crystal Palace Football Club, just signed a new contract. Can you get your reaction to that? Well, I'm delighted. I'm delighted to be re-signing. You know, I've been here for six years now and this will take me just shy of a, a testimonial, so delighted to be re-signing and uh, looking forward to what the future has in, in store. As we saw your last contract was run down, we started looking at old clips of you at the club, just in case we had to make a special yeah. montage. <laughs> but it's a good moment, haven't it? Yeah, it's been some fantastic fantastic moments it's been a great ride and uh, long may that continue um, you know I wanted to I wanted to stay here and want to be a part of it and um, you know I feel I feel uh, at home here so it's, um, it's important for us to, to keep moving forward and, and to be a part of that as well. What moments have stood out for you the most? Um, to be honest with you there's been so many uh, you know obviously the promotion season that will always stay stay with us just because of the achievement that we We've done and we create history as well with staying in the Premier League for the time that we have and we've kept that going. Um, so there's been some great moments uh, game-wise as well. There's been some fantastic little standout bits which obviously always stick in your mind. Um, some sad bits as well obviously with the FA Cup final and everything like that but you know that's, uh, that's part and parcel of the game so you just got to ride the storm when it comes. Was it a frustrating season for you last season with injuries? Uh, yeah, it was just you know obviously you want to get back as quick as you can and you want to you want to be playing. Um, I think any any footballer in their right mind doesn't want to be sat watching when you want to be involved and you know when you want to help out the, the squad and the team. And um, you know I said from the from the beginning all I want to be doing is is playing football and that's the most important thing. And I do everything I can to make sure I am playing football and and. Um, Hopefully, I won't have a season like that again. Going into your, I think it's your seventh season with the club. The first season without Damien Delaney around the place. You're going to miss. It's going to be quiet. <laughs> <laughs> no, yeah, Damo, you know, he's a fantastic guy. Um, you know, and I've, I've obviously known him for the whole time I've been in the club. Um, and okay, well, Damo came in the same same season as I did, a little bit later in the window. Um, but he's a, he's a great guy, and he's he's a testament to him for you know doing what he'd done at the club and um, being a part of the club and taking the club forward. I think he was uh, instrumental in that as well and uh, you know, I wish him all the best for, for his future and for whatever happens next after football in a few years. I've seen on your social media, you go on some pretty cool holidays, you don't go on the classic footballer Dubai <laughs> Ibiza thing, do you? You've got to mix it up, right? Yeah, so what's your, where, where would you recommend people go? Um, fantastic time in Iceland, it was great. Um, Travelling around, just seeing the seeing the landscape in the country, which was which was pretty awesome, pretty incredible. Um, obviously, America was was nice, but that's a bit of a more of a standard standard one. Place ourselves up in Santa Barbara, up in the, on the west coast, and then um, we've done a little bit of Tuscany as well. So culture, don't you? Wow, well, <laughs> don't know about that. <laughs> you just had the first session back. Um, how do you think the team can do this season? I think we've got a great great platform to build from. Um, and hopefully with the stability of having you know, the gaffer um, staying on with us as well, we can really start to um, bed in and get a good pre-season under our belts and, and start the season strong. And you're clocking up that record of most Premier League appearances for Palace Fair. Do you think we'll see your testimonial here in 2022? Oh, I'd like to, like to see that. Um, not sure anyone will turn up, but it'd be, <laughs> it'd be, a, be a good crack. Uh, no, I mean, obviously for me, I, I want to play. Um, for this club and I want to continue to play and I will continue to to set that standard and, and set that bar as high as I can um, and for as long as I put the boots on I will never stop trying to better and trying to uh, raise that bar. You've managed to watch the World Cup? Yeah, managed to see a few games here and there. Um, obviously time zones when uh, the games were being played was a little bit more tricky. I was out in the States so it was early mornings and, and whatnot but um, managed to see a few games, not as much as I would have liked to, but that's, that's life. And um, you know, we, we settled down and watched the rest of the rest of the games now are coming up. How about a goal from that French right back? Is that similar to your one against <laughs> Arsenal? Yeah, I don't know about that. Um, I think he took up a notch there, so I'll have to try and get another one this season and put that right. <laughs>